I'm Jen, and welcome to Bariatric Support Online video. Today, I'm going to tell you how to make a really quick and easy snack. Um, it's blueberry bites, and they're covered with high-protein Greek yogurt. I got this really fancy ice tray that has silicone bottom, so you can push it out once they're frozen. Um, you could use a regular ice tray, but it will be a lot harder to get them out without sort of warming it first. And so all you need is an ice tray. And the smaller they are, the more poppable they are. And what you do is you just take blueberries and you put one in each of the little slots. You can use any kind of fruit you want. Um, I just picked blueberries because they're in season right now and they're my favorite. So I'll just put these in. Uh, you can do one to two in each slot. These are pretty big, so I'm just going to do one. And then, um, this is Fire Greek yogurt. Uh, it's 2% and percent fat. The higher fat content you have in the yogurt, the lower the sugar content is. And you're looking for a, a low sugar snack for this. So, um, and that's usually how they lower the fat is they add more sugar or carbs into the yogurt. So I don't want to add sugar or carbs into this snack. Um, so you just take a teaspoon uh, and add the yogurt on top of the blueberries. And with this snack, I did the math for you. And it, if you eat three of these little yogurt bites that are all frozen, it will be one gram of protein and a half of a gram of carb. Uh, just because fruit is a carb already, I didn't want to add extra from the yogurt. So that's why we're just doing plain Greek yogurt. And I know that that flavor is harsh if you've never had Greek yogurt before. Uh, you can add a little bit of honey to this or a little bit of stevia if you need that little bit of sugar to get you over, I mean that sweetness to get you over the Greek yogurt hump if you've never had it. But if you just pound this down like this, it gets the air bubbles out and lets the yogurt go under the berry to kind of hold it in. And then if you do have any that you need to fill in, you can just add a little bit more to the top. And uh, these are not too fancy. So if you're having a very fancy dinner, don't serve them. But if it's just a snack for you, that's up. So, um, all covered with yogurt and no air bubbles. And then they look like this. You just stick them in the freezer for three to four hours, then you pop them out with this little fancy silicone bottom, and then you can put them in a baggie and they'll stay in the freezer for three weeks or so. I doubt they'll last that long because these are going to be delicious. I hope to see you soon and have a good day.